Inside Pabli Connect, we released a new feature today, and this new feature is really amazing because it will make things really, really simple for all the business users out there. Uh, let me just show you some amazing things, and I think that will be a much better demo in this specific case. So I'm just going to click on New Workflow, and I'm saying IDA Forms to Google Sheets because we want to send data from IDA Forms to Google Sheet. So the new amazing feature that we have launched is the response format. And as you can see, there are two different type of response format. One is the simple response and another one is the advanced response. Now the simple response, what it really does is that whenever any new data is coming over from IDA form, what it will do is it will just capture the data. It will simplify all the incoming data and then it will show you all the steps to map that very same data into the next steps. Okay. At the same point of time, if you are an advanced user, you can again toggle this response format to advanced. This will give you all the packaged data inside arrays and all those kind of things, which means you can actually apply advanced functions like iterators, extractors, and just about anything that you really want. Okay. Uh, now I'm just going to show you the whole demo. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to click and I'm just going to make sure that the response format is simple right here. Then I'm just going to type in IDA forms. Okay. Next, I'm just going to choose the method as new response. Then I'm just going to click on connect with IDA form because I have already my credentials saved in which I used the API key. I'll just select my existing credentials. Then I will just click on save. You will see it automatically fetched the forms from my account and you can see all the forms are appearing right here. Okay, so I'm just going to click on registration form right here and I will make sure that my response format is simple because we really want to see all the extracted data uh, without having to use JSON extraction in the first step itself. Okay, again, this is for business user. For advanced user, you can still use the advanced function and it will actually give you the whole array which you can extract, iterate and do whatever you really want to do with it. Okay, so I'm just going to click on save and I'm just going to click on send test request. As you do that, you will see that you will get all the data right here ready to be mapped. You can see the first name is right here, the last name is right here, and the email address is right here, okay? In the next step, you can just click on plus, just choose Google Sheets, click on append values. In fact, there is one more amazing thing that I just wanted to tell you. Uh, within Google Sheet, we are also coming up with new update. Uh, inside Google Sheet, you will be able to map them without the double quotes, okay? I will show you how you do it using the double quotes, but now uh, coming forward, you will not even have to do the very same steps. It will be much, much more simpler for average business users. Again, I'm just going to click on connect with Google Sheets. Uh, I'll choose one of my credentials that I really want to use. I'll just click on save. It automatically fetched the response type demo sheet, which I actually created right here. It has just three fields, first name, last name, and email address. And then I will just add three pairs of double quotes. Okay, so I just added three pairs of double quotes. I will just place my cursor right here. The first name is right here. The last name is right here. And then the email address will come right here. Okay, once we do that, we can just click on save send a test request just to make sure that everything is working fine we will go back yes it is working fine we will click on api response and we'll just save it okay and you can see your entire workflow from ida form to google sheet is connected and created the amazing thing is this will just consume one task because we do not use any uh, we do not count task on triggers so this will be just one task whenever the google sheet will be updated so i hope that you will like the response format feature now, the response format feature gives power to business user as well as advanced developer users. They will just love it. So thank you for watching this video. I do hope that you will like the new feature. Thank you again for using Public Connect.